Hello guys and welcome to my channel. In this video, I would be explaining you Johnson's algorithm, which is used for sequencing. Here, I have taken an example in which there are six parts to be man manufactured, and corresponding time taken on machine one and machine two are given like this: two, nine, eight, and so on. Similarly here, so we have to sequence all these parts. So how to solve? Now before starting with the video, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe my channel by pressing the subscribe button below. Also, if you find this video helpful, please like the video, comment if you have any doubt or suggestion. Also, check out my other videos. All the links are given in the description. And uh, if you find this video helpful, please share and do not forget to subscribe. Now starting with the video, here there were six parts given corresponding time on machine 1 and machine 2 so you put six blanks a b corresponding to because there were six part so you put six blanks or six dash now what you have to do by johnson's algorithm it says that take machine 1 here you have to find the least of all these time here it is 2 so you take 2 strike off complete complete row you strike off that is here you strike off you take 2 because it is minimum corresponding to 2 it is a so you write on the leftmost here a now go to machine 2 now remaining will be 7 12 3 9 and 14 because it will be a striked off when you strike 2 all right so you take the least of these so here it will be 3 so corresponding to 3 it will be d and you strike off completely this so you write d on the rightmost again go on machine 1 now 9 8 4 and 11 will remain so minimum is 4 you strike off corresponding to that it is e so you place on the leftmost here it is already filled so e comes here all right now on machine 2 you get you get 7 12 uh, 7 12 and 14 so minimum is 7 strike of this you get part b you write on the rightmost so b comes here again go on machine 1 8 and 11 will be remaining all others are striked off so 8 is minimum so corresponding to 8 you write c leftmost you write c because these two are already filled in the previous steps so leftmost will be blank space will be here so you write c here and the only remaining is f so you write f here so answer would be a e c f b d so we have to sequence these in a e c f b d order so this will be the answer so this was the video regarding johnson's algorithm if you have found this video helpful please like the video comment and do not forget to subscribe I post videos daily regarding all these topics and uh, you have come to the right place for all your doubts and learning. Now signing off, take care, bye bye. Wherever I go, wherever I see. I remember